Hey guys, Brian with Thunder Laser USA. So this is the uh, Thunder Air uh, external compressor interface uh, kit. And um, basically it's just a uh, regulator with two dryer uh, water separators. And we've included 10 feet of quarter inch or six millimeter airline. And then this uh, Type D uh, fitting that fits all the Cali air compressors and pretty much uh, universal for most standard air compressors. Now these uh, quick release fittings, you press down, they're like the ones on your air assist nozzle, you press down on that plastic collar and it'll come out. So what you wanna do is first of all, when you get these, this is gonna be locked and it's probably gonna be wide open. If you pull down on this, that will allow you to be able to adjust the pressure and it is wide open right now. Righty tighty, lefty loosey. So uh, looking at it this way, clockwise uh, is less pressure and counterclockwise is more than when you get it in place snap that in and that'll keep that from turning so what you want to do when you get your kit is uh, typically the easiest way is mount it on the back of the machine right near the air inlet and you're going to use a small section of this to go from and there's arrows here to show the direction of airflow this is the inlet and there's your arrows showing that it's going this way and this is your outlet that outlet you're just going to cut a small piece off whatever you need to go into the laser and then use the remainder of this on the inlet side and then just plug that end into the compressor now um, there's also some uh, drains on here and these are spring-loaded and when you first start your compressor, you're going to hear it hissing out of here. And after a while, they'll build up enough pressure where that will lock. Uh, if it bothers you, you can hold these down until they catch or give them a little flick as they're starting to seat. Uh, and that'll help them out. And then as the pressure eventually uh, bleeds off the line, these will pop back up and all the moisture will drain out the bottom. So you may want to put a container, a Tupperware bowl or something like that under there. Um, just to help contain some of that water so it doesn't get on the floor if condensate is released. Uh, but anyway, that's the kit. And if you have any questions, you can check our support site at support.thunderlaserusa.com. And uh, just do a search uh, for a regulator or Thunder Air Kit or uh, just look in the Air Assist archives and you'll be able to find full documentation on it. Hope that helps. Thanks. Bye-bye.